my Virgo signs, welcome to my new YouTube channel. This is the first in a series of um, monthly zodiac forecasts that I'll be doing. Um, so clearly not everything is going to apply to everyone here, but I'm hoping that a lot of you can take something from this in some way. So let's just get on with it and see what comes up. Okay. Right, I feel from this card, whoa that um okay I feel like you're feeling quite responsible for certain things at the moment I feel like either there are people around you and tasks which you feel like you're giving a lot of, of your energy to or yeah I feel like there's something taking your energy at the moment um and actually you're kind of refusing to um to realize that and to and to really realise the effect that that's having on yourself and your body. I'm feeling this like real, okay, we need to relax here. Um, it's okay, um, but the situation needs to be, this situation needs to be looked at. Um, and there's some astrology coming up, which can really help you here, actually. Um, so we've got, um, we've got a Mercury, we've got Mercury retrograde coming up on the 5th which is a real time for introspection and going within and we've then got we then got the new moon in aquarius on the 6th i'm working with real time eastern astrology here um so um the new moon energy is going to bring up things which have been suppressed for quite um for potentially for some of you for quite a while and i feel like here this is relating to this 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 thing that's taking your energy i'm really feeling it um so actually the mercury retrograde energy of um reviewing and um kind of going within i feel like it's a time to say to, to just shut the doors even just to for briefly while you kind of <laughs> you need to look after yourself i feel like this is about getting back to self-care and this mercury retrograde energy is going to help you do that for these few weeks um and with the new moon energy bringing things up that perhaps you've refused to see in the past, I think you're going to be looking at things in a very different way. So going into this Mercury retrograde, I feel like it's going to be, it's going to feel quite overwhelming because you're going to feel like, well, actually, this is the way that I've known things for so long. And even though um, yeah, I've taken responsibility for a lot more things that, than I've needed to, this is what feels natural. So um it's not necessarily going to be easy to kind of just push those things away as much as you can. Um, obviously for not everyone is going to be able to do that depending on what it is that's taking their energies. But, um, for whatever that looks like for you, this play, this, this time of going within is going to feel at first very overwhelming. Um, but actually just going back to this card, there is, there is a sun at the end of this, um, once we get through the fog. So next card, um okay i feel like this is about um when you go within to make sure the focus is on compassion and empathy and love <coughs> and peace um so <laughs> this is about compassion for yourself and um compassion for those around you so if you feel like things have taken your energies um it's about having compassion for that it's not necessarily about blaming those things because if, if things are taking our energy we've allowed that to happen but again to have that compassion for yourself to say okay well maybe yeah review particularly the last four months with the since the last retrograde what is it that i've done um and yeah what energy am i giving out that has, has enabled people to take it um and how am i not protecting myself and about forgiving what's happened in the past um, yeah, there's just this real focus on compassion and trying to see where the other person is coming from. Um, for example, if this is about people um, or about yourself, about, okay, I've allowed this energy to leave me, um, but it's okay. Okay, I feel like this is talking about... Um, this introspect I feel like we need to come back to this um this energy of um introspection and mercury retrograde I feel like 
there's a need to to ground here okay so I feel like um, whatever's happened particularly over the last four months um, with this this giving away of energy let, yeah I mean I would say we have the choice of whether to give our energy away so let's see it as, as a giving away it's um, disconnected you from um, a place of stability which you may or may not have, have experienced before this real strength but I feel like what you're going to be going through now is is going to be quite difficult at first um, and feel quite overwhelming but actually the end result is that you're going to be a lot more rooted um, in yourself and from that place you're then able to give energy to others and to projects in a much richer stable way because you're going to be drawing energy up from within um, yeah it feels like a real p place of strength actually um, finishing um, I would say coming towards the end of March I feel like the, the first couple of weeks could feel quite foggy but um, there is that sun at the end let's pull one more card yeah okay so these two cards <laughs> are very similar actually what we've just had so this is about the grounding work. After the grounding work, there's a real place of strength and a real, um, you've set your boundaries and you're now very clear about what it is that you want to now let in and what it is that you're not gonna allow in anymore because you've seen the, the damage that it causes. So yeah, there's a real positive feeling of strength coming at the end of Mar of March here um, but in order to get there you have got to go through a few things first but nothing will ever be sent to you that you can't deal with so I have full faith so yeah I hope that that um, means something to some of you and that you can take something from that I've got a video coming up next week um, around, about the new moon that we have in Aquarius coming up so um, yeah, tune in. This may be able to give you some more hints about how exactly to use this energy, even um, even more in order to get to that real place of strength which is coming to you. So yeah, I'll see you then. Bye.